So, just to let everyone know, this is not going to be my first time completing the game. In fact, it's not even going to be the second time completing the game. I have... Where's the achievements anymore? I don't know. It's been so long since I've played Xbox. I have 100%ed Final Fantasy XIII with a 1,000 gamer score. I've also 100%ed Final Fantasy XIII Part Two when we get on to that one. Uh, so yeah, I've got about 120 hours on one playthrough and 40 on another. Uh, my plan is to get to the end of this one at around 40 hours as well. I'm not going to be doing too much farming. I'm not going to be trying to max out the Crystallarium. I'm not going to be doing any of that stuff. But I am definitely not going into this blind. It has been a while. It's been about a year since I've played this last. But I'm not going into it blind. I do plan on playing Final Fantasy XIII Part Two and Lightning Returns. Lightning Returns would be blind uh, in the near future, as I plan on doing all the other ones. And those will look, should all be going up on YouTube. Uh, I still have yet to edit Final Fantasy X. But at some point. Without further ado, let's get started. And I have phased back into existence now because we are off of the bright white screen. Lovely. Hey, Metal, been a while. How's it going? It is a very pretty game. For 13 days after we awoke, though it is uh, Xbox 360. Of the end. So it could be prettier. The PC version is better, but there's no DLC for the game, and I already owned it on Xbox, so I figured, why bother? I do, however, have uh, Part 2 and Lightning Returns on PC, so we will be playing those on PC. Serious? Be quiet. And since I have 100%ed the other two, part of me does want to 100% lightning returns. However, I doubt we would do that the first playthrough. She did it. What I've done with almost all of the Final Fantasy games is play through them once for the story, and then I'll go through it again and look stuff up if I don't know it or stuff like that. And uh right? hundred percent. I'm out of the sea. Oh, I'm doing pretty good, thanks for asking. So far so good. Good for them. Here's for the good luck throw. I might need it. So thinking ahead as to how I'm going to get this on YouTube. Give me that. I'm probably going to be lazy and just do it as stream exports um, rather than editing it. I'll edit out any grindy bits that we do. Because there's at least one spot where I will be grinding uh, for some money, which will be about 
halfway through the game, first third of the game. Then there'll be some more later on for the Solarium points. So I'll probably edit those out. Otherwise, hopefully, we'll get through this relatively painlessly. I say that, I'm going to die so many times now. I know it. It's going to happen. Okay, big robotic scorpion thing. Let's fight. Hey, hey, hey. let's be rational now. Uh, Send the big guns out. What do we do? Watch and learn. I believe I have turned off the tutorial messages. Uh, at least during combat. Unfortunately, I haven't turned off. The you can't turn off these tutorials. You can't skip them though, so goody. I know what I'm doing. I mean, it's very, very simplistic at this point because we don't have uh, any of the extra stuff yet. Yeah, there is. There is the. I think it's part four, twenty-four of uh, my Kingdom Hearts playthrough was the Kurt Zeezer Death Spectacular. That shouldn't happen in this game. Hey, that wasn't like a challenge now, all right? Hey. Come on, Saz! Jump! Ten out of ten for the landing. This thing won't give up. That looks painful. That wasn't that bad. Yeah, we shouldn't have any problems here. Cutting it a little bit close, but you do heal up to full uh, between battles. Unlike some of the older uh, Final Fantasies. That said, this isn't exactly young. This is what, six years old? Five years old now? you supposed to protect civilians, soldier? I mean, you are Sanctum, aren't you? What are you doing trying to stop the Purge? Why don't you tell me that? I was a soldier. Hey, where do you think you're going? Man. Chocobo, we just can't catch a break, can we? 
That's a good question. <sighs> oh well. Better follow her. <clears throat> I'm getting too old for this. No, yeah, I believe it's it came out 2010. Didn't it? Been around a while. I don't need this tutorial. Uh, no. Please, please don't. Ugh. Sure we can get here? Unfortunately, there are a lot of tutorials. Nope, nothing there. I am an item horse, so be prepared for insane amount of searching for items. So this will be my third playthrough according to save files. Come here. You want that chocobo, the chocobo chick. Well, don't worry, you'll be seeing lots of them. So I'm just going to try and get through a lot of this starting stuff just as quickly as I can because it's, none of it is challenging. Um, but it, it does last a while. The game's quite linear until about halfway through where it opens up a bit and then it goes linear again uh, but you can before the final fight you can go back to the open world bit because there's a bunch of side missions and things like that I'm probably not going to bother doing many of the side quests. I might do a couple, but this isn't going to be a 100% playthrough just because I'm not prepared to triple the playtime to do that. Then again, a large part of that was farming for um, upgrade materials. But yeah, I'm not interested in doing that this time. Am I excited for Dark Souls 3? Of course I am. I am looking forward to my April death spectacular marathon. Not wanting to get purged, I get. But taking on trained soldiers? Uh. Better to die than get sent to Pulse. It's hell for those two. Yeah, well, hell's not sounding too bad, because this place ain't exactly paradise. Domesticated peacekeepers. Nothing to worry about. Well, maybe not for a soldier girl, but I'm trying to say, hey, 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 I love Saz. I just love him. Lightning is a badass. But Saz is just... He's the average Joe that's actually funny. Lightning is not waifu. Then again, I'm not really into the whole waifu culture thing. But no, if you were if you were gonna have a waifu, it would be uh, Sarah.
Though she is kind of taken. Kill these guys, and then I think there's an item. Around here. Come on. Attack. There we go. Do you not know about waifus? It, it's basically a uh, subculture from um, manga and anime and things like that. Uh, where people choose a character who they would want to be their wife. Except more often than not, it's not actually a matter of them wanting them as their wife, it's them wanting them as a sex object. Gil, oh boy, I'm rich. <laughs> yeah, perverts, and then you get the, you know, the body pillows that are that have the print of whoever their waifu is and things like that. Preemptive strike. Rebels. So much for the element of surprise. I don't need item usage tutorials, I know. I know, thank you, Skip. This is not my first time playing. Or is it my first Final Fantasy? There we go. Like I said, just trying to get through this as quick as we can. Uh, let's save for the heck of it. Come on, get up there. God damn it. There's no time. Then what do you suggest we do? Quiet. Hey! 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 hey. Wait! Uh, no, no, don't leave me! God damn it, Saz! Now look what you did. Uh, you're able to turn off the battle help messages, uh, but you're not able to just turn off. The right. tutorials, unfortunately. Let's beat the shit out of these guys. You've got to sort out your gaming schedule. You got addicted to just playing online at the minute. Nothing wrong with that if that's what you're enjoying. I I've been looking into Black Desert Online a little bit recently. It's about to be released in the start of March. And it's an MMO which looks quite similar to Dragon's Dogma in several ways. But I would need to um, I'd need to have people actually play with me. 
but it's a it's a pay to play, although I don't think it's subscription based. I'm not entirely sure though. Final Fantasy game, you can never save too much. Although, the good thing about this game compared to the older ones is that you can just retry if you fail a battle. So. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with Fallout. I caught myself playing a little bit of Fallout 4 the other day. This is not our lucky day. Just created a new character and was mucking about in it. Deportees, are we? Weapons down. I hate for this to turn ugly. Uh, turn ugly? He wants to kill us without a fight. Time's up! Oh god, for god's sake, no, please let me skip this. Thank you. At least they're letting me skip this. Survival was fun. Um, I could see a melee only character being fun if you built yourself correctly. I think Margin did it with maximum agility. Because it's with maximum agility, you can teleport. Something like that. So, soldier. What's your angle? What? Was classified military info? Huh? What's the matter? You quit, didn't you? Did you think I'm gonna go out there and just tell everybody oh, your secret? Huh? My angle. I'm after the foul sea. <laughs> Still happy you tagged along. Yeah, you can teleport. Not like literally just teleport all over the place, but um, like there's a blink strike or something. So you can pretty much teleport to an enemy and smack them with a melee weapon or something like that. I never did it myself. More like extermination. Huge. You stay here. So sorry. I didn't mean to. These people need heroes. Here. You keep your cool, and they will too. You got it? Got it. What's our motto? The army's no match for Nora. <laughs> that a boy. <laughs> oh, 
I'll definitely be getting Final Fantasy 15. Enjoyed the demo. Episode Dusk A. What the fuck is going on in this story? Well, it hasn't fully been explained yet. But basically, there are people that are being deported from uh, this land because they've been tainted by a falci from the world below. Pulse falci. And uh, the sanctum uh, people don't want uh, this is crazy. them around. Take a nap. Really? Can I? Sure. And when we're taking a dirt nap, you can save them all. No, oh, that's even worse. No dirt naps today. We're all in this together. Our enemies, the Cocoon Sanctum. They're dreaded Psycom, no less. What's the dread? Psycom's nothing but a whole bunch of bluster and bullying. They've got nothing on Nora. Well, we are the heroes after all. <sighs> Let's prove it. Yeah. yeah. Should you get up and do stuff, you're still in bed. Bed's, bed's a good option. Nothing to worry about. And besides, you're in America, so it's not that late for you. Half three over here. Oh yeah! I forget, do I actually earn crystal points doing this? So, can I explain why a bunch of cosplay models are the ones fighting? Japan! Need I say more? I don't think I am earning them. No, I'm not. Makes sense because I've got nothing to use it on yet. Ah, uh, no more. <sighs> there are soldiers everywhere. Yo, boss, what's the plan? We'll charge in, guns blazing. Hey, that's not a plan. Real heroes don't need plans. Okay, so we get to kill a bunch of things. And then we get to really be here. It was really, really wrong being back to my old setup, where I have to wear two pairs of headphones and things. Same plan as always. Hit them hard. I'm glad that I've got the rest of the trilogy on them um, on PC. Not because there's anything wrong with playing it on you know, console, but streaming from Xbox 360 is just. Pain in the butt for me.
Or at least the bits where fighting things mean something. Because at the minute I'm not even getting experience. I am getting items though. Which could be useful. I mean, it, it's never a bad thing to have potions in Phoenix Towns. Hello. Yeah, real heroes only need fists when fighting armed people, except okay? he does use grenades. Hey, careful with those. <laughs> Don't worry. No one's moving to Pulse today. We'll clear you a path out of here, so be ready Wait. to... Wait! Let me fight yeah, with you! you can't expect us to just sit here! <laughs> Could help. Yep. Please, let us help! <laughs> okay, then. Volunteers front and center. Here, take this one. This here you go. And one for you. Count go me for in. It. Here's yours. Real heroes don't need arms. Now envision all the protagonists Mom? without arms. Don't worry. Huh? So I just hold it steady. Yeah, yeah, feels good. Yeah, uh, nice. Can you show me again? Uh, you got That's it. how it works. You sure? Yeah. Moms are tough. Right. It's the last one, boss. All right, last one. Somebody take it. No, no. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Push comes to shove. Keep him safe. First impression of snow? All oh. top. <laughs> All right, yeah, let's just low, point a loaded gun fine. at someone and we'll pretend to shoot it. We're going home together! Come on! Everybody up! Right, new recruits, on me! Come on. Right. Time to go, kiddo. <laughs> that kid is unfamiliar with gun safety. Along with most of America, it seems. Oh, I didn't realize I already had nine back then. Oh well. Just increases our health a bit. Stay sharp. Hi, guys. There we are. Agreed, people are dumbasses when it comes to using guns. The main point of using guns should be don't use guns. Except for very specific circumstances. And in those circumstances, be very, very careful. In case you're wondering why I say this, there are a considerable, and by considerable I mean larger than zero, amount of people that have died in America because they're dogs, 
or toddlers or whoever have accidentally shot them to death. I mean, if, if you have to worry about your dog shooting you to death, it probably means you're not doing gun safety right. Hey, big boy. Heroes don't run from fights. It's okay because people in that world can easily withstand multiple bullet hits. Yeah, this is true. In this world, snow can survive multiple bullet wounds. There's nothing we can't do. But I still don't think it's a very good idea to just point a gun at him. Specifically, is like head. Then again, he's pretty thick-headed. So. I have never understood Kado's way of fighting. It's like he's trying to be E for it. That's what it reminds me of. The red hair and that stance just makes me think of E for it. We gotta win this! Ta! That also, both Kado and LeBru are firing two-handed weapons with one hand. Why have I only just noticed that? LeBru even has a like a powerful rifle. I mean Godot is an SMG, which I can kinda understand, but he still has to fire it two-handed there. Nice try. Oh, that looks like it's going to stick. I told you, didn't I? Moms are tough. Heroes only need one hand for any weapon. Well, fuck. Everyone's dead. So much for being a hero. Well, Mother's Day is coming up. That's going to be awkward. We have to move. Right. Sure. Why not? A 
Okay, so this is Saz and Lightning, right? Yep. It's an out and out massacre. Most people won't even live long enough to die on Pulse. That was the idea. What? Sanctum logic. They conjured up the courage to eliminate a threat. I mean, why carry the danger all the way to Pulse? Why not just stamp it out here? Execution, masquerading as exile. That's all the Purge ever was. <sighs> Relocation to Pulse. How does the government get away with pulling crap like that? And you, you knew this was gonna happen? The Purge was Psycom. Private Sanctum troops, not the Guardian Corps. Psycom? Guardian Corps? Soldiers are soldiers, aren't they? Pulse Fal C and their Lassie are enemies of the state. Tell a soldier to kill an enemy, and you really think it's gonna matter what uniform he's wearing? Might have mattered to that one. Couldn't shoot. Got himself shot instead. How about you? Hmm? Or to say shoot, you pull the trigger? Fine. Forget I asked. See you, Metal. Cheers for coming by, man. Hey, Scott. Got a hangover. Well, whose fault is that? Hope the night out or the night in was good enough to make up for. That's what you were looking for. Yeah. Right in there. The post file C. It's too much, isn't it? <laughs> Face it later. Uh. Ciao! <laughs> hey, wait! You 
said it made you happy when I smiled, didn't you? But really, I was afraid. I was always afraid. I wonder if she's going to be important in the rest of the story. So, how do you figure that Pulse Falsy is different from the Sanctums? Mm. All things being equal, I just as soon keep wondering. Time to jump. Yeah, I know. Hey, 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 <laughs> hang on! <laughs> can do it, so can we. Yeah, well the chocobo can fly. <laughs> Emo beaver, an odd Aussie accent girl. Mm -hmm. What about the others? They didn't die. They couldn't have died. Heroes don't die. Hey, get a grip, man. What's wrong with you? Look around. Get him home. Get who home? Toss me that. Catch. What are you doing? So what are you afraid of, huh? You're supposed to be the hero. Yeah, let's just point She's another gun there, at our friend. Bride to be? Isn't it about time you picked her up? Yeah. <laughs> There's our ride. <laughs> now you're talking. So there's clearly an item in front of us. Is there one behind us? Nope. I hope everyone's alright. Everyone's dead. You killed them. You're a terrible human being. You doggy doggy. Okay, so kill these guys, steal their motorbike, and then what? Feeling that from the mini map there should be an item in here. Yep. 
200 gil. We're really rich now. Look, there they are. And the headphones are already starting to kill Everyone my head. Ready to fire. Stay sharp. All right, on my go. Right. Go. Ugh. Yay! All things to kill. Now, now we take the motorbikes, yeah? Yeah! That's a sad sound. Where's the soul? Okay. Hey, Godot. Yeah? If you don't know who you've got to save, you just protect them all, right? <laughs> Something on your mind? You got plenty of time for thinking on the way, hero. <laughs> God, it annoys me how many times they yeah. say, I'm a hero! I'm a hero! You're a hero! Let's be heroes! Heroes! care about kids favor for a friend okay hey snow you made it hey yo <laughs> so hey. you really managed to use that thing <laughs> i think i'm done you're done when we are Ow, what? <laughs> that's the one <sighs> didn't you have something to tell him yeah Right then. But I. I'll go with you. What? Oh, you have no idea what it was like. Oh. Everyone's safe? <laughs> the, the army's, army's no, no match, match for Nora. Nora. I meant the kids. <laughs> well, uh, all accounted for. Keep it that way, all right? I already hate him. Hey! I'll swing by the vestige. Keep the kids out of trouble. You got it. Say hi to the missus for me. <laughs> You go skirt chasing, I take care of the kids. Some husband. <laughs> Dinner's on me. Better be home cooking. When's the wedding, <laughs> lover boy? <laughs> well, don't worry, none of you are invited. We're still going. Hey, you you serious? Hey, what about me? Catch you later. Rudy. Not real. No way is he. Oh, I not know. 
I'm gonna take this one. Hope you don't mind. Okay? I want to tell him. It's just that... Uh... Say, you know how to fly this? Well... Yeah, I think so. Hope right. feels that Snow <laughs> killed his mother. In you go. So I'm sure that what he wants to say is something along those lines. That way. Uh, no, no. A little bit lower. If we go in there, that thing could... It could make us lassie. Uh, this is... I don't think I can... You can do it. Uh, what are you two doing? Uh, here we go. Uh-oh. Uh Ah, uh, the rebellious teenage years. The pulse fell sea. It held our future. And our fate. <laughs> <laughs> 